What's up guys? This is Joe Ducati Boy. If you've seen my other videos, you probably know this is my idol and my favorite movie ever. And last weekend, went to this cool place. My boy Mikey hooked me up. Got an amazing deal on this. I don't like statues normally, and I've been getting them lately. Just I'm never satisfied with the face sculptures, face sculpts on statues and busts. If it's like a Spider-Man or cartoon character, they look great. But when it comes to like human, they just don't do it for me. Not like Hot Toys. But this one is beautiful. So I figured I'd do it outside in the sunlight. It's just gorgeous out here today. You can see the sun is blooming. Got the TV going on in there. What the hell is my dogs? Look, there's a little my little bitch Summer. Chilling in the sun. Cooper! I don't know where the hell Cooper. There's my buddy. There's Cooper. Cute little shit. Cooper the Pooper. Yeah, went from a Rottweiler to these two little rats, but they're awesome. Alright, sorry about that guys. Gotta make sure they don't run out of the backyard. So anyways, got a really, really good price. This thing came out a couple years ago. It's limited. And I believe, let me see if I can flip it to the bottom. So I can show you guys real quick. I'm just so excited about this. Alright, so it's by Hollywood Collectible, Collectibles Group. They make some pretty cool stuff. Oh shit. It's number 8 out of 100. Not bad. Made in China, of course. Nothing's made in good old America. But let me not get into that. Uh, pretty damn detailed. Beautiful bronze statue. It's just, look, you can see the veins. Done real well. The arms. I just opened them up. So excited. So I haven't looked them over completely, but... Check him out, he's got his little scar going on. The bandana. Really nice. Nanny D. YouTubers. Nanny D, you gotta get this piece, it's beautiful. I know you like Stallone, he look great with our inner base stuff. Just really nice. The quiver, the arrows. Sorry about that guys. Even the hair, it did a great, great job. Look at that. They put the little wrinkles like it would have. Nice stone going on. So I got lucky on this particular day. I saw on Test Jess's video, I'm a fanatic when it comes to Mad Max. I wish. Hot Toys would make some Mad Max figures, but I noticed this Mad Max car sitting on the shelf and I was gonna ask him where he got it. And I just so happened to see it in the store. I love it, blew me away. Came out a couple years ago, but look, not a fingerprint on it. It was never opened. This thing, it's so detailed. I'll show you that in a minute. So the sculpt, I'm stunned as to how well it is. It looks cool. I'm sure someone will say something about the eyes that are a little off, but to me, it's great. So the packaging, it pretty much came, look, you got the shipper box with the info, and then the main box is just a black box, there's nothing anywhere, and you know, you got that. And I noticed something that Hot Toys never has. Quality control passed. Hmm. All right. So that's pretty much. Oh look, he's got his scars on the chest. It's so bright out here. I can't really see if it's coming through, guys. Sorry if it's not. I'll bring them in in a bit. So for the packaging on the interceptor, you can see. Uh, look. Never displayed, brand new, still screwed in box. I had a 
you know, I had the cool things on the bottom, you gotta unscrew. So it's a 118 scale Mad Max 2, the Road Warrior Interceptor. Packaging I love. Get the picture on there. I got a good deal on it. I did not pay that much, but I checked on YouTube. It's kind of what it's going for. I'd never seen this before until I saw Kevin's video. So I got lucky I saw that in there. And I just got this bad boy. So you got the side over here. It's made by Auto Art Millennium. The back, you know, it's got some pictures going on. You got some credits, I take it, some info on it. And there's a website, don't know if it still, still exists or anything. I'm trying to look for a date. I don't see a date on this. But I doubt that it's recent. So let's check out the car. And you can see right there, it's just beautiful. Got the blower going on. It's just sick. It's beautiful detail. I used to collect these little cars back in the day when I stopped. Just everything. And it came with these cool little accessories. The detail on them is sick. Got his dog. Real cool details on the dog. He even came with the little dog food that he ate in the movie. Real sick. Uh, let's see if I can get close here. Uh, really cool. Got the two cans, this box. Two machetes they look like to me. Two petrol containers. Uh, extra tire chain on it. And that's pretty much it. I just got to place the wing on the back. I don't want to put it on yet because I'm, I'm not going to display it just yet. But, yeah, really cool detailing, guys. Little netting in there. The sickest thing happened today. I went to a little convention, like comic book thing. I get there, and what do I see? A guy who's made one of these, but like the real thing. Sick, sick. I took a quick like two minute video of it. Put it up on the end of this video so you guys could see it. Alright guys, just wanted to share this. Really excited that I got it. So, got this bad boy. And cool old Rambo. My little rat, one of my rats sitting there. Cooper! Oh, there he is. Stop running away, I'm gonna throw you in the pool. So, came with the cool dog. I kinda got, this is a real life one to one scale. Hey, Coops. Alright, guys. I'll catch you on the next vid. SS out.